What's up, y'all? It's me, your girl, Key. And I am back with another video. And hopefully you guys hear me good. I lost a little muffler. <laughs> so I might. I think it's at home in my other purse. But I am in downtown Savannah. Getting ready to walk into this black-owned coffee shop called the Culturist Union. Um, it's like a marketplace for like artisans and just it just from the outside it looks like a, a good vibe but I've been hearing things about it in like my Facebook groups and I have a book here with me I have this book I'm gonna chill for an hour or so kind of just read and just be with myself and enjoy my time lately I've been finding it hard to just like enjoy my alone time so that is what today is all about in this book i actually heard about it from the know for sure pod with b simone and megan brooks i'm sure you guys have heard about it it's an amazing podcast i love it i'm not even a podcast type girl this is the only podcast i have ever been able to just sit down and just listen to and watch and laugh and probably pretty sure i probably cried a few times as well such a great podcast but B Simone was saying how she's been reading this book and it's pretty good so far it's all about just addressing that voice in your head and just really getting to the bottom of why we let this voice run our lives um but yeah this is a long intro I'm sorry <laughs> if you have not subscribed yet go ahead and hit that subscribe button but without further ado let's get right into this black business slash vlog slash solitude video <laughs> All right, y'all, so I am back home. I had such a great time at the Culturist Union coffee shop. Everything about it was great. The vibe was great. The coffee was good. It had just nice music playing the whole time. I also connected with some people um, who really gave me good insight about just 
working on your inner self, especially if you're out here trying to be a leader or influencer amongst people. Like, how are you going to do that if you're not even correct and right within? So that really resonated with me. But I also went to the gray market after I left the Culturist Union, which is another Black-owned cafe in downtown Savannah. Um, I have a separate video specifically for different Black-owned businesses in the downtown Savannah area. So make sure you go check that out. And if you do stop by the Culturist Union, let them know that the Key Exposure sent you. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and do that now, please. Like this video. All of that helps me out so much. But that is all for this little video, short vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next Black Business Review.